for Ethiopian coffee is a big thing for us. Coffee originated in Ethiopia. And we have our tradition drinking coffee. It's like having a conversation. It's not like just to wake up. Sitting together, having that ceremony. She's making it because it's fresh roasted every morning. Having that is a big thing for us. When we moved here, it was not a lot of Ethiopian cooking. Now there is. But when we moved, it was just a few of us. Like in Charlotte, there's like a couple of African restaurants. Like, you know, the best way to teach your culture to people is to look at I was born and raised in Ivory Coast. So when I came to America and I met a friend, I started going to a salon to help. And then I found out that I can make a living out of it. Charlotte is completely different. Anytime you come back, it will be like, oh, you see that place? You see? Charlotte keeps changing, which is good. And I tell people, I say, we all growing together. We growing with Charlotte. Yeah, it make me feel more comfortable. It make me feel like I belong. Because when you are diverse, you learn. Like me, for me, Patrick, I like to learn from people. I like to learn how people live, what they eat, how they dress, their way of thinking. That makes me grow. We've been in this location since uh, September 2019. I grew up in the eastern part of Ghana, Koforidua, which is the name of the city. Our food tastes just like right in Africa. Our major meals are from West Africa. I've had somebody come here after eating. He sat down and he was very quiet. He said, man, I haven't been home in 16 years. Thank you for bringing something close to me. Our slogan is be royal, taste Africa. So even if you haven't been to Africa before, you have the best taste of Africa here. I feel like here is my home. I belong here. Even when I go to Africa, I'm like, it's time for me to go back home. And one of my nephews said, here is your home. I said, check on my driver license. It's not Ivory Coast, it's North Carolina.